Hello guys, welcome back to our Katia V5 lesson. Uh, in this short tutorial video, I will show you how to use the pattern. So what is a pattern? So if you look at this object, you look at this uh, hole, alright. These two hole is made by pattern, means that it will have a same shape as the previous one. And also, it will have a, the same distance with the original one. So, this is the distance. Okay, which is the same. Alright. So, <coughs> so where you can find the pattern. Okay, is uh, actually in the transformation features. If you look at this uh, icon here. Alright, if you expand it, you have uh, three actually type of pattern. The first one is rectangular circular pattern and user pattern so i'm going to concentrate on the rectangular pattern first all right so i will uh, uh, call it undo first okay i will press this one okay obviously uh, the pattern definition box will be appear okay so if you look at this, there's a uh, information that you need to fill in the first one is the instances if this is, is how many pattern that you're going to repeat or copy you're going to make all right so this is a spacing between between of the patterns all right and also we have the reference element which is where you want to pattern to be formed or to be executed all right so and then what what, what is the object do you like to pattern all right for in this case let's try two or maybe three okay what is happening all right Next, I will fix the spacing. Okay, uh, what is the reference element? Surely, you press it, you highlight it, and you highlight also the the surface. Okay, look. If you look at this, it's also pattern the object, this whole object instead of the uh, the whole. So what you should do is, you need to press this, select the the right object to pattern so if you look like this is already have three which is equivalent to this so you can increase okay how many you want depends okay for example this you can increase the spacing like here i will increase slightly all right so if you preview it's done okay next this is our one direction how about if i want to do the whole here it's a pattern okay it's pretty simple what you can do is Alright, you need to have a second direction. Okay, bear in mind which direction you want. You can always select the uh, change the direction. For this one, if going to upward, I will move it to the downward because I want to make all the pattern below here. As usual, you can uh, next what you should do is uh, tap put the second tap direction. Alright, so you can apply more. All right, so you can also increase the, the the distance between or spacing between of it, and you preview. Okay, I put more. All right. Okay, this is another function that uh, worth to note that is to, for example, that if you want to move this pattern instead of going to this direction or the down direction, you want to move into the center of it. Okay, means that it balance between of it. So this one is going to be your center, which means that this will be distributed evenly between the left and the right. So what you can do is you, you just press uh, more. Okay, all right. And this is another definition box here, all right, which is the row in direction. You can play around. So you can, you can if you increase a number, you can see that it's already uh, changed the direction similarly to the direction 2 so the direction 1 is based on the uh, I call based on the the direction this is direction 2 this is direction 1 okay right and also you can play around with the degree okay for example if you want to rotate it okay so it can be done as well right Right, this is a pattern. So hopefully you can understand. Alright, as I said earlier, if you want to move the copy, like something like this, you can also do that. 
right the the things you have to note is uh, you have to select the appropriate surface okay so I press a pattern okay since I'm going to play around with this direction this plane I will choose the element here okay you can see all right but it's not right because it go up or go down if you select the uh, the error so we have to be careful you select the uh, the plane so I will change the plane instead of there yep so it's done okay All right so I try again put more increase the space and put second direction preview press ok so it's done alright so this is uh, the pattern ok uh, another interesting is uh, if you have any object that really not stable ok not I mean that it's not a uh, what we'll call it mm, uh, not really uh, in the curve for something like this so we have to be careful because if you pattern sometimes it's not because this is the original original okay so so if you look at this thing this is not go through into the object so whatever is when you extrude this thing make sure that it is you extrude more than uh, the height should be more longer than this direction than this side so that's why on this case I only extrude up to here only okay all right that's for the uh, what call it pattern so I will going to uh, give you example for the circular pattern later on all right stay safe everybody